After college, I moved to California and I started working on a number of environmental campaigns. I got involved in helping to save the state's last ancient redwood forest and blocking a proposed radioactive waste repository set for the desert. Shortly after I turned 30, I decided I wanted to dedicate a significant amount of my life to solving climate change. I was worried that global warming would end up destroying many of the natural environments that people had worked so hard to protect. I thought the technical solutions were pretty straightforward. Solar panels on every roof, electric car in the driveway, that the main obstacles were political. And so I helped to organize a coalition of the country's biggest labor unions and biggest environmental groups. Our proposal was for a $300 billion investment in renewables. And the idea was not only would we prevent climate change, but we would also create millions of new jobs in a very fast-growing high-tech sector. Our efforts really paid off in 2007, when then-presidential candidate Barack Obama embraced our vision. And between 2009 and 2015, the U.S. invested $150 billion in renewables and other kinds of clean tech.